Here we are with the Ford spindle. We got the grease fittings removed. This is the original press-in fitting. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to modify this to use a modern Zerk fitting. Actually Zerks have been around a long long time but the Ford used a, a fitting that still pressurized grease but the gut, grease gun doesn't lock onto it and it doesn't have a check ball to keep the grease in. Dirt can still get in the fitting. So what we need to do is this is a 5 16th hole. In order to tap a 1 8 pipe thread we need to drill the hole to 2164. So you need a 2164 drill bit. That's a 64th of an inch bigger than the 5 16th hole. You're not removing much material at all. You're taking about seven and a half thousandths per side. And then we're going to tap the hole with a 1 8 pipe thread tap. Basically we're going to tap just deep enough that this grease fitting will fit in fine. This is actually a short grease fitting too. Some of them are about a quarter inch longer. You want to use the shorter ones. You have plenty of material but on this one you don't want to bottom out and hit the hit the actual bushing you're going to press in. But that's one of the modifications we're going to do on these spindles before we put them back in the car.